Protesting is essential in having a healthy government-citizen relationship. People want to be able to speak up when they disagree with something the government has done. This was the plan in Beijing, China on June 4th, 1989, where people gathered in Tiananmen Square to air out their grievances with the Chinese Communist Party. The main issues that they had here were with corruption, inflation, and limits on political participation, among other things. Students and workers had also gathered to protest more issues with the CCP, with students calling for freedom of press, democracy, and freedom of speech, and workers calling for a solution to inflation and welfare erosion. Well, largely disorganized, these two groups were the most vocal of the protesting bunch. Unfortunately for these groups, the CCP had no intention of making any of these changes. This resulted in many violent clashes with authorities, as eventually martial law was declared, and as many as 300,000 troops were mobilized to Beijing. In the end, the protests were largely unsuccessful, and estimates of the death toll ranged from several hundred to several thousand, as official numbers were never released, and this topic continues to be censored in China to this day.